All right, guys, we're into 1956 now. And what you're looking at is 12 different 1950s space guns. These, uh, these are before our first regular looking dispensers, not regular regulars, but the ones kind of dispensers we know about today. I'm missing a few colors here. Uh, gold is not in the picture, transparent orange, not in the picture. There's a shade of blue I'm missing somewhere between these three on the right. And there's a shade of that lavender. But I think I've got the rest covered. Uh, I want to show you that there's something different here. First, let's talk about what you got to look for when buying one of these things. You want there to be some uh, the trigger to work. That'll at least tell you the parts are working inside. The rubber bands are, what are we, 70 years old almost. So, you know, the chances are real good those have been replaced. You want to look to see that this white piece at the end isn't chewed up. Same with the trigger piece. And then this back piece is going to have some language on it. It's going to say, made in Austria, patent pending. And then you've got this, uh, the white piece at the bottom. Inside, you want to make sure you actually have the cartridge, which has a little bip. Hold on, guys. I don't want to break this. This one's nice and cool. All right. That's, uh, in this case, kind of a marbleized black. This is the predecessor to your normal Pez dispenser. It's got um, a squared off thing holding the, the candies. You want to make sure the spring is working. Now, other than that, here's a couple things to look for. Um, some folks will tell you that all the parts the white parts are interchangeable from one to the next. And I'll tell you that that's not the case. And in fact, these two reds look identical, but they're not. Let me see if I can show you what's going on here. Uh, let's see. If you take a look on either side, okay, let's take a look at the rocket ship first. Okay, there's a rocket ship there. Nice, skinny rocket, right? Here's the other one. That rocket's a lot fatter. Let's see if I can put them next to each other for you. You see the skinny one on the left? Fat one on the right? Those are different molds. And this part on the bottom is a different size. You try to put it on the wrong one, it's not gonna match. I'll show you that in a second. But one thing that I find to be more interesting is if you look at these stars, the, there are three here, this big one, is a five-pointed star, but these, I'm not gonna be able to do this, hold on. Those are six-pointed stars. It's six points. Now, if you come to the other gun, they're five-pointed. Maybe you can't see in the video, but take a look at yours. You're gonna have five-pointed and six-pointed. And they do not, the parts are not interchangeable. Let's do this. I don't know if you're going to be able to tell. One of them is going to be wider than the other. Do you see that? The one on the left is a wider shoe than the one on the right. What else have we got here? You can see the, the five points clear on the silver one. You see those? Those are clearly five-pointed stars. And then if we go to the blue right next to it, hmm, how do we, there, 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 do you see it? Six pointed star, six pointed star. The small ones are six points. There's no question, that's different. What else can I show you? Um, otherwise, they're, and the alignment of some of the stars is gonna be different. Take a look here. All of these, all 11 of mine, have a star here on this side, but this black one does not. I'm not sure what's going on there. Uh, and then lastly, I'm gonna break this. Jeez, man. Uh, take a look at some of the stars. This guy, I'd say the star is is proper, right? It's like standing up on these two points. And the point on top, pointing up. 
This one, it's upside down. All right, I'm looking at the same side of the gun. This one, the star's pointing down. These are pointing up. My point is there are a number of different molds out there. This is not one mold making 12 different or 15 different colors. There's a lot of differences out there and the parts are not interchangeable. Uh, you're gonna end up breaking something you try to force something on. So be careful out there, folks. Enjoy your 1950s space guns.